You might be wondering, what was my source for my last video? It was actually a live stream done by Tommy. It's still on his YouTube channel. He started a live stream outside of the house they're staying at to look at thunderstorms. But about three hours and one minute in, a couple members of the house walk outside and they start talking in a very interesting way. Now, you might be wondering, why didn't I say that in the other video? Why didn't I name names and directly call out who was saying what about who? Because it is so much funnier to know that they're going to probably be looking it up and trying to find it out and end up watching the whole thing, not just the segment, particularly about them. Now, someone that was brought up in that video, I do want to talk about a court document. You see, Kenneth Joseph Owen Thomas, also known as Joseph Thomas, also known as Joe Thomas, also known as Pianon, also known as the creator of Sing for Freedom. He wants some change, you see. The defendant, Thomas, has been invited to give a sermon and lead organized prayer at a conference July 7th to July 9th, 2023, in Rogersville, Missouri. The conference is called, and they seem to have forgotten the page. The conference is called Truth and Light Festival, which, funny enough, is going to have attendance from members of the Freedom Corner. Um... What a coincidence, I must say, that this happened as a 4th of July celebration right before this event. But I also want to uh, point out something that I put in just the comments of my last video. This is why you should like, comment, and subscribe to make sure you don't miss anything. The ending, when they're walking back into the house, they do admit something that they hate to admit. At least one of them finds Anarchy Princess attractive. <laughs> 